fly. Actually, let's heal up a bit first. Makes sense, doesn't it? Oh, what are you doing? Oh, that heals everyone, doesn't it? Maybe that's a good idea, actually. Quicker. Oh, don't make that enemy come towards us now. Leave me alone. Please. Thank you. Yeah, it's pretty bland. I mean, the fact that you're a robot's pretty amazing, but... Ooh! Didn't expect to get a new bat here. 30 more attack again. Nice! Just run away from that one, can't be bothered. <laughs> I've reached a point in this game where I just can't be bothered to fight anymore. And that happens in RPGs for me once I start getting towards the end. I think it's the longer battles and the harder enemies, I can't be, you know. Who can be bothered to fight long battles in RPGs? We're leveling up while we're wandering around, I suppose. That's one good way to look at it. Yeah. Oh, another ball! How many balls are there going to be? <laughs> Have we got anything to heal up? I think we might need to. Jerky? Actually, it's not HP we need so much, it's PP. Swing is due. I can use a PSI caramel on Ness. Because I want him to have as much PP as possible, just in case he's the only one who fights this last battle. <laughs> I keep assuming it's the last battle. But who knows? That can have some as well. Here we go. Let's go. Oh, it's more of this crappy place. <laughs> it's just easier to run away. <laughs> I hope this don't come back to bite me in the ass. Oh, okay, this is a bit different, isn't it? What are they meant to be? Like robotic. What? They look like rusty pipes. Or, or, like, guts. Human guts. But why, why would we suddenly come across human guts when we're going in? Oh my god. I think we've made it, folks. It seems like a centralised place, isn't it? Oh, it's Ness again. Ness keeps on popping up outside his body all over the place, doesn't he? Even in the past. Pokey! Are you surprised? It's me, Pokey. I assist only the strong and able. That's Pokey. You guys look pathetic. The Apple of Enlightenment has already made a prediction, but I won't let what the Apple of Enlightenment predicted take place. You guys will be beaten by Gygus. Gygus will be stronger, a more powerful entity than any other. He's actually going to have to show up if he wants to beat us, you know? I was led by Gygus, now I'm here. Master Gygus. No, Gygus is no longer the wielder of evil. He has become the embodiment of evil itself, which he cannot control on his own. He is the evil power. Um. Oh okay, my here we go. It's time for what's bound to be one of the final bosses. Let's have a look. Gygus. Gygus has a giant ball with Ness's face on it. Oh, wow. Okay. I'm just going to attack. I, I don't really know what's going to be good for this fight. Uh, multi bottle rocket, might as well use them now. And as for him, what should we do? I don't want to hit both of them, I just want to go for Pokey first. I get the impression that Gygus might have um, something going for him. Ooh, it's solidified, amazing. Gift save, okay, use that. Not that good. Anymore. 
<laughs> ah, amazing music kicks in. Danger and fall. That didn't do very much, actually. I thought we would have done more. Yeah. Freeze. Hopefully it'll freeze him again. We'll use another one of these rockets, but it didn't seem to do brilliantly. Don't matter, we'll, we'll do it anyway. Okay. Oh shit. Is she gonna die? Don't miss your dick. So that's quite good. See that shit? Actually, no. He's gonna have to do this. He can do multi bottle rocket again. And he can try and revive. Okay. This might turn up horribly. We'll see how this goes. Oh, don't. Come on, come on, come on, come on. What are we talking about? He was using it before he even died. Okay. Use healing on Paula this time. And healing on Isaac. Come on, let this work. Right, everyone's alive again. So I'm going to use life up. I think I'll do this every turn actually, just heal everyone. I think that's the best way to go about it. Multi bottle rocket. Hoping it'll do a bit more than last time. And freeze again. Shit. Didn't realize the health was so low. Come on. Stop taking half out to use a move. Oh, see, she's dead again now. Okay, that's fine. He's not the one attacking anyway. Heal up is that Oh his H look his PP is getting low again. Good, he was gift same. It's fine by me. He's gonna go straight back? No he's not. Just about live. Again. I hope I'm doing it this well now. I don't know. to try and get this in as soon as possible. Shit, you know. It's always gifts so in it. Always. Oh come on. I don't know what to talk about. <laughs> I've already sort of said everything I want to say. I want to see this boss is mostly. Oh! I understand you guys were already claiming to be heroes. Well, it's a gazillion years too early for you to oppose Gygas. You must feel pretty stupid to keep fighting without even knowing what Gygas looks like. If you were to ever see Gygas, you'd be so petrified with fear you'd never be able to run away. Uh oh. Uh oh. I don't know what's happening. Shit, it's like a phase two, is it? I'm terrified too. Gygus can't think rationally anymore. And he isn't even aware of what he's doing now. His own mind was destroyed by his incredible power. What an almighty idiot. Um. Okay, it's all well and good to be threatened by something that we can't even see. Right, that's good. Try and revive... Try and revive Polo as well. Lads out of PP, is he? I didn't realize that. Don't know. Um, magnets, try and get some PP back. Doesn't have any PP, okay. Hmm. 
Oh dear. I've actually heard about this boss, by the way. I think we're going to be fine. She can play. Defend and defend. Lads HP are maxed out. Oh good. What am I meant to do now though? I know that you have to just pray for this part. But how the hell... <laughs> Can't grasp the, <laughs> the severity of the attack. Ooh, a lot of damage there. Okay, we'll do it again then. Why not? Multi bottle rocket. And he can't do much. I'm just gonna defend with lad, because his attacks are not good either. It's physical attacks. Ooh, that is a lot of damage. <gasps> yeah, she did did some damage too. Damn it, that didn't work though. Just gonna use this one now to save a bit of PP. I'm gonna try this one more time, it's our last one anyway. I actually need to heal up a bit because of Polar and Lad to an extent. Yay! <laughs> nope, okay, that was a waste. Carry on praying you. Heavy bazooka? Maybe that'll work. Probably not, but you never know. Just attack you. <laughs> One HP of damage. <laughs> oh, nice. Didn't realize it was an electric attack. Yeah, a bit of that. A bit of... Actually, let's just go for an attack, shall we, with a heavy bazooka again. And defend. It's a weird boss. Oh! Hello! You must really be at the end of your rope. In this bizarre dimension, you four are the only force fighting for justice. Okay. Come up a shed it here. When did Porky turn into such an arse? He's been... Actually, he's been like him most of the game, but at the very start, he wasn't. He couldn't fight to save his life, but he wasn't an arse. Try and call for help. Here's the hint that tells you to use prey then, I see. I see how it is. Oh, we're off. <laughs> off again. Doing a lot of damage, but I don't even know if we need to. No, oh, don't use gifts, you pleb. Use life up. Defend, defend. I'm happy. <laughs> There's a gorilla song in there somewhere. Please give us strength, if it is possible. Please, somebody help us. Here we go! Have we have we finished the game? Oh, they've returned, okay. Um Um <laughs> A million Mr. Satins getting together! All of the Mr. Satins felt a new, startling feeling. There were more Mr. Satins in the village than that, I'm telling. 
Yeah, I saw one of his gnaws on the right there. Oh, git. Defense is becoming stable. <laughs> don't matter that he's numb. We don't need these characters anyway other than Paula. Do nothing. Defend. It's not right, not right, not right. <laughs> I don't think it's right. Good, so long as it doesn't work on Paula. I'm not exactly happy that they're dying either, but, you know. Ooh, Summers. And he prayed fervently for the safety of Ness and his friends. That's nice of him. Oh, 41 damage. Thanks, Runaway 5. You're amazing. Alright, Mr. Riyad. I'd like to revive one of them. Really? But I can't. I don't know what this does. Leave on Ness. <laughs> HP. And PP. Oh, good. He needed PP. Let me just pray again, please. Thank you. Speed this prayer to all the people of the earth. Pole Star Preschool. And that's that dirty perv who was just after Paula, wasn't it? Was it him? <laughs> Paula's father thought he somehow heard his daughter's voice. Oh, it's not a perv, it's his fa her father. <laughs> Bit of a difference there. Well, I suppose a father can be a perv as well. Bit more damage to him. Oh, come on, we can do more than that. I want to revive... Lad. Oh, yay. Got him before Gigas could get an attack in. I'm having, no, I'm having trouble saying anything today. I can't formulate a sentence anymore. <laughs> That's worrying. Ah, oh, is that is that orphanage place? Here they go. Are they actually going to be able to do much? Suddenly, Tony felt anxious about his hack. Oh, here we go. Let's see what this does. If it's just damage again, I'm going to slap someone. <laughs> Shocking. Yag, yag. <laughs> yag. <laughs> Who knows? Okay, good. And then you need use. Why is Paula's HP going to. Ah, oh, was she. Because she was over it, that's why. Oh, no, not another one. Don't let Paula die, please. Oh, good. <laughs> Lad can die, that's fine. But not Paula. Here we go again. It's funny how Paula is the most useful character in this final battle. Lad's place. Uh, Delam. Yeah. Oh, not one at a time. Come on. Don't come out one at a time. Okay, good. She began to pray for the well-being of Lad and his friends. Ah, oh, that's quite nice. Ooh, the damage is getting bigger. Great. I'm happy. <laughs> I don't quite know what meant to be going on here, but... Yeah, take that, you bastard. Stop hitting yourself. Here we go again. Who's it this time? <laughs> the McDonald's. 
<laughs> the McDonald's staff suddenly start praying. <laughs> yeah. Oh wow! Damage is getting huge. I know you're happy. You don't have to tell me every turn. <laughs> it's getting a bit repetitive now. I know it's meant to be this big dramatic thing at the end, but... Is it Ness's house? Oh, that's nice actually. I quite like this one. Ooh, she knows something's up. She looks like Paula. Nessa's sister looks like Paula. I'm surprised Sparky didn't have more to do with the game, considering we had to name him. Oh, this is going to be huge damage because of who it is. Wow. Oh, are we done? No? Okay, again then, I guess. Nice, 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 nice. I saw an image where if you pause or screenshot the image in the background now, just look at one of them instead of all the different ones that's going on. It looks like a fetus, apparently. Yeah. Oh my god, can you stop please? What am I meant to do now? I tried praying, they didn't do anything. Can't think of anyone else. Someone, anyone, please help us. Oh, she found someone. Paula's call was absorbed by the darkness. Oh no. So what do I do now? I don't know. Try again. But what does it mean that there's a fetus in the background? I don't know. Please give us strength. Is it going to work this time? Touch the heart of... Ooh. Great. Prepared for the kids. Having never... Oh. Oh, wow. Who was that supposed to be? Ian kept praying. Oh, is each dash like a missing letter? It's me! It's me! I'm praying for the characters. With all my heart. <laughs> it's very funny. Oh! Huge damage I'm dealing. Greeny kept praying. My voice is cracking up like hell. <laughs> wow. Yes! I think we beat him. Oh, he's... what? What? Yes, now I... well, it's going to seem like I'm running away, but perhaps I'll just sneak away to another era to think about my next plan. I wonder if he's in the next Earthbound game, because this... it's not called, called Earthbound, it's called Mother 3. So there is a game after this one, and one before it as well, but that was a NES game, so... there probably wasn't much to that. But yeah, I'd like to see Mother 3. Or play it, but who knows if that's ever going to happen over you. Um, game? I think you're breaking down. <laughs> I think we beat Gagas, but never met him properly. Oh dear, I certain my views. Our robot buddies. The war against Gygus is over.
Oh, sorry about so that. My phone rang. Then I needed a was, you know. Bad bladder. Bad. <laughs> oh, I think this is this souls going out and going back to their bodies, probably. So when they said that the souls might not be able to go back to their real bodies, it was a damn right lie. We're gonna have to bury them all. Oh, nope, nope. <laughs> I thought so. Look at that weird Mr. Saturn on the right. Just bobbing in and out of the screen. <laughs> nope, he's going. He's bored. Yep. <laughs> oh! Finally, Ness. Of course. We're alive! I must return to the lamb and use this experience for the good of my country. Don't go, lad! Let me demonstrate a strange power before I go. I realize this power is a child. PSI, farewell. That's a nice little power. Oh. What are you up to, Isaac? Rubbing against us. Paula, Ness, it was great to hang out with you guys, it really was. I'm glad that I had the chance to use some of the theories that I have been studying so hard. It's remarkable. If, just maybe, well, if you two get hitched someday, maybe I'll be the one that fixes your broken electronic appliances. <laughs> He's going to be the Curry's or Comet Man. So it looks like this is goodbye for now, my friends. Bye, Isaac. Oh yeah, that's his dad, isn't it? <laughs> I forgot about that. Ness, will you escort me home? Yeah, of course I will. I have to go back to being just a regular kid. I think that's important. When you grow up, you can start doing random crap like this. Oh, we can move around. I thought we were done with the game. Letter from Mom. Letter from Tony. I'll read them now. Hold on. Letter from kids. Paula's mates, is it? I don't know. From our mother first. Since you left home on your journey, things have changed around here. For example, I don't have as much laundry. <laughs> also, we don't seem to eat pizza as much as we used to. That's because we were the ones who loved pizza. But then again, doesn't everyone love pizza? Hurry home, okay? Tracy, Sparky and I are waiting for you. Mama. Ah, that was cute. From Tony. Dear Isaac, Isaac's not around anymore. What's the point in giving us the letter now? I wish I could have gone with you on your adventure, even just part of the way. But instead, I'm sitting here waiting for you in winters. I want to see you again as soon as possible. Can't wait to see a cheerful face. But the glasses are dirty. Oh, dirty, Isaac. Filth. Don't show us like that to anyone. Oh dear. <laughs> and kids. Dear Paula, how are you doing? I'm fine. I'm fine too. So are me. Me also. Me okay. Please come and play with us again at the Paul Star Preschool. One more thing. Bring us some presents, if you have any. Nope, none for you. Nothing for you. Okay, so we need to go to wherever the hell it was, Tucson, that's the one. Bye, Isaac. Just the two of us. I can't remember where to go now. <laughs> I can't find... Pre can imagine not being able to find the preschool now, at the very end. Wouldn't it be funny if this wasn't the end of the game, and there's just a million more things coming, because there haven't been any credits yet. That would actually be too much for this game, I think. I'm, I'm sort of ready for it to end. I've enjoyed it well enough, but... You know? When an RPG is really long... This one hasn't been that long, actually, but you know what I mean. Thank you for escorting me home. 
There was something I wanted to tell you, but I've forgotten it. I'm sure I'll remember by the time I see you again. Goodbye. So long. See ya. Farewell. I'll read us saying goodbye. Now it's time for us to go home. I think. <laughs> Teleport. It's nice being back in the net. I haven't been back here for... Well, other than when we went to the Meteor, but it was all a bit different then. The long walk home. Long and lonely walk. He must feel lonely now, after having mates with him 24-7 for the last... However long the game was supposed to last. Yeah. We're home! you become such a strong young man. I like to hear all of your stories, but I don't want to annoy you as soon as you walk through the door. Your chats with people you met on the adventure are finally over. Please come back here. The photo man bought an album by. I'd like to look at it with you. Oh, this is... Is this where, um... We get to see all the photos that were taken? Okay, now you can finally share your incredible experiences with me. You did so well. Ah, oh, here we go. We're going to get credits and everything. <laughs> dancing. Even the dog is dancing. Ah, uh, she's coming to do a little Irish jig as well. Yes, the cast. Okay, so... Oh, it's not the actual credits, is it? All the minches, the evil gits. I forgot about Picky, we saved him at the start. Buzz Buzz, the dead fly. Liar X, exaggerate. Adjurate. <laughs> yeah, whatever. Didn't see much from him after. Frank Fly, free healing place I forgot all about. The Sharks. I can't quite remember what they were all about. BH Purple. Know him. Captain Strong. He was the police. Yeah, all the police people. Paula's mum and dad. Paula with her teddy. Orange Kid. What a waste of time he was. Sort of you. <laughs> Apple Kid. He was a lot better. Mr. Everdread? He nearly died. Good on you, Mr. Everdread, for getting in the credits. Gonna we fight? Happy Happiest? That was an interesting town, I enjoyed that blue town. Carpenter? Yeah, all part of that. Ah, oh, the Bubble Monkey! Tony Maxwell from the Orphanage. Can't really remember Maxwell. I remember his name and him being something pretty important, but I can't remember. Tessie, Tessie Watching Club, Brick Road. He became a dungeon, that was the creepiest thing to come out of this game. Dr. Andrew Nuts, yeah. Of course it's blown up again. Isaac. <gasps> it's the Mr. Saturns. Haha, <laughs> we didn't give it the font of it. <laughs> the shit pile, Master Belch. George Montague. Yeah, the gold miner. Gerardo Montague. Can't remember you. Wasn't he in Saturn Valley at the end? Talarama. <laughs> yeah, the monkeys. Geldegard Monotoli. Oh, of course, he was an evil kid as well. Except he sort of didn't like his evilness at the end, did he? Venus. Lad. Lad's master. And the weird guy who kept chasing us around, Star Master. I think this has been a long episode. <laughs> Dungeon Man, Noble Warrior. It's not going to go into every little person now, is it? Fender Transman, yeah. <laughs> Flying Men. Most of them died. One of them survived because I didn't use him. And a shit ton of them. Okay, so this has been Greeny XI. I hope you've enjoyed this series. I found it really weird doing a blind RPG, getting stuck all over the place, and having to try and merge things so that you didn't notice too much. Because that's annoying as hell when you see someone die over and over and over in a series like this. Uh, yeah. 
I've enjoyed it. I think it's dated a little bit. It's got some annoying characteristics, like towards the end there's a massive difficulty spike and I just ran away from all the enemies and still beat the last boss, so it was fine anyway. The music is amazing. The graphics I love more than most modern day graphics. Hold on, is there going to be anything more? Ah, oh, the photo album, yeah. Uh, I found it hard. It's been a very hard game compared to most modern RPGs. Overall, I liked it. I really liked the uniqueness of it. The sort of humour it brought along everywhere. Hmm. I don't think there'll be another game quite like it, to be honest. Nino Kuni sort of remind the first town in Nino Kuni sort of reminded me of one on it, one at in Earthbound. It was a lot like it actually, it was like a modern day town with a weird little kid running around. Here's all the photos. That was the house that we bought with a beach in the background, which was really nice. Oh so I I'm trying to think now what else to say. Yeah, I'm going to be taking a week break, if you're watching this as they're uploaded kind of thing. I'm going to be taking a week off now. Maybe a tiny bit longer, but I can't see it happening. As a break, because of how much effort I put into this series and the fact that there were three other series going on at the same time as this one at different points. So I think I need it. So I'll see you again in a bit. I've got plenty of other series in the backlog if you fancy having a look at some other stuff. Plen There's plenty of big name games like Final Fantasy 8 and 9, Resident Evil, well all of them except for 6. Um, and a couple of little games like Flower, Rain uh, and Sonic 1 on the Master System. Alundra, that's one that I'm particularly proud of and I hope, I hope people are enjoying that. I wonder if the credits roll faster if you had less photos. <laughs> I wonder. So, I think I'll cut this off here. You can watch the rest of the credits, and if anything else happens after the credits, then I will come back and talk a bit more, I guess. <laughs> as much as you must love my voice by, by the time you've seen all of this. So... I'll see you again in a bit. Oh yeah, oh yeah, um, what my next series will be. I haven't really thought about it. I've considered two possibilities, but I'm not going to mention what they are. I like, I like my LPs to be a nice surprise when they first pop up in your little YouTube channel feed thing. Dino. <laughs> I remember that desert. The little sesame seed things never came to much, did they? I thought there would have been a bit of a plot, um, you know, having to do something to do with them to earn something, but nothing really did happen. My voice is actually going now. Mao. How do you pronounce that? M-A-O. Mao? 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 Maybe. Mapper. That can't really be his name. Map checkers. Mapper. <laughs> I bet they hired him just because that was his name, if that was the case. Our time at McDonald's, that was amazing. Had a good old burger. <laughs> Look how happy Ness looks. Couldn't really see it because of the text in the room. But... They just gob open with a massive grin. He loved this little adventure. And Lad looks so upset. Angry even. But yeah, I'll see you again after all the credits. Uh, see you in a sec.
What? Hal Laboratory, like the Smash Bros people made it. Wow, I didn't realise that. It's no wonder Ness is in the game, as well as him being a Nintendo-ish, Nintendo character. But, you know. <gasps> me! <laughs> it's me! And you lot, obviously. You lot need to be thanked and everything. And appreciated. And in all honesty, I appreciate you watching the series. Um, is that it? Okay, so this has been Greenie XI. I hope you've enjoyed. I'll see you again next time. When we check out the new series, check out my vlogs, see what's going on, I don't know. See you in a bit, folks. Hold on one crafty little second. After leaving the controller for a bit, the phone started ringing. Let's see what it is. Hello, it's your dad. You've been out there for a long time now. What the hell? I'm at the end of the game and you tell me to take a break. I... what? Well, okay, whatever. I... <laughs> what's the point now? Am I meant to be doing something now? I think this is meant to be like a full circle thing where Pokey will be there and he'll be saying, let's go see the meteor or something like that, do you think? Oh, it's Picky. Picky Pokey Picky. A letter away from my brother Pokey. It's addressed to Nest. It's no stamp and it's not time for the ma mailman to come. Okay. Come and get me, loser. Spankity, spankity, spank. <laughs> I wonder where he is. Wah, wah, wah. The end. <laughs> <laughs> what? <laughs> but yeah, I want to play Mother 3. I don't know if I would let's play it. Maybe if I enjoyed it a hell of a lot. Maybe then. But that really is the end, I think. I thought that last time, but I think this time is saying the end, so it must be the end. This has been Greeny XI once again. I hope you've enjoyed. I'll see you again in a bit, folks.